Hello, welcome to this new host of our video. My name is Alex. Today we're going to have a first look at the new UXG Pro. So we, we got our hands on a UXG Pro a little while ago and we've covered some setup guides, how to get adopted to Hostify, and that sort of thing. But one of my colleagues, Asaf, um, who works on support, he managed to get a hold of a UXG Pro in India and he's done a he's done a nice unboxing for us. Um, and so we'll put that in the put that this in this video in a minute. Um, let's have a quick look at the UXG Pro. We haven't really discussed the overview of the device yet. Um, so it was launched uh, about two years ago. Um, it was in beta process for a very long time. Uh, it was about it was in the EA store for two years. Uh, it didn't look like anything was actually going to happen with it. And then miraculously, uh, you actually released it early this year, um, just out of nowhere. Uh, it's on it's on sale. So the, of course it's out of stock. Um, it's also four nine nine in the US. Um, but it's quite unique. It's sort of the replacement for the USG devices. Not quite the direct replacement for the USG 3P as we thought, but it's more of a replacement for the USG Pro 4. Um, so we've got two, uh, we've got two Ethernet ports and two SFP Plus ports on the front. Uh, so we've got two WANs and two LANs. So uh, WAN 1 is here, WAN 2 is there, and then these can be all remapped as well within Unify, just like the UDM Pro and UDM SE. Um, it's basically a UDM Pro inside but without the switch uh, without the controller and without the hard drive it does the dpi ips and also has a smart power outlet for your modem which doesn't quite work yet uh, i've got one running here and it even though i've got it disabled within unified it's still it still just reboots a modem that's not even plugged in there is some differences between the eu version and the us version so the us version has a uh, a standard mains outlet on the back for the smart power whereas the eu version has a iec lead so it basically has another one of these but a um, a dip like a female version basically as well. So and also the smart power connector as well. So I'm just gonna hand it over to Saf now. Hello, myself Safan. This is unboxing of UXG Pro. So we've got the UXG Pro in the box here. Saf just opening the box now. So there's a little box with the accessories in, which we'll get to in a minute. And then the UXG Pro is quite special. It comes with a DAC cable included. So this one's a copper copper DAC cable. Uxie Pro in its uh, styrofoam packaging there. So the Uxie Pro is a 1U device. It's got included rack ears as well. It can also be mounted to a tabletop. You can see their SAFS version you got from India has got the same uh, connector on the back for the um, EU. So you've got the 1.3 inch touchscreen on the front as well as the four ports on the right hand side. On the back they've got the smart power connector as well as the outlet for this modem and then the mains power lead as well that's the DAC cable that came with the box got a few accessories be a power lead and some accessories for the rack ears and screws as well as some rubber feet probably as well so there's the accessories the yeah, rubber feet with the sticky pack uh, some screws for, for a one new rack and screws for the rack ears as well. Also came some bit of paperwork as well. 